Welcome back, everybody. If you're hanging out today to watch Control, thank you very much for being here. We'll see how we like this game and if we'll start this series or not. Um, ho hopefully we'll enjoy it. It's supposedly a pretty good game. From what I've been reading and looking at. The reviews are pretty good. So let's see how far we can get into it uh, with the two hour window at least. And we'll go from there. If we will wish to continue, then we'll see if we will. Continue it tomorrow. New game, brightness. Adjust the brightness until the left icon is not visible. <clears throat> uh, and the middle icon is barely visible and the right icon is clearly visible. So that's pretty much like right there. Like 50, I can see it. That one, I cannot. Yeah, I'm going to say 47. I almost want to say 46 to be deadly sure. Yeah, we'll go 47. Slightly higher. All right. Enemies will try to flush you out of cover using grenades. Look for the grenade indicator and quickly move to a safe distance. All right. Good hit. I was debating whether or not to use a controller on this game. This is going to be weirder than usual. Can't be helped. You called me, so here I am. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like... We live in a room. And there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room... And the poster. The picture's something nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, oh, what is it called? The prison movie. The room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, Sometimes, something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen, freak out. And try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Hello? Wow. Anyone here? Pretty good intro. Just kind of try to take it all in. That zoom. <laughs> 
correspondence. Press G. Get assets. Materials. House memory. Astral blip. Conceptual material. Astral blip. Uh, entropic echo. <clears throat> Threshold remnant. And corrupted sample. Collectibles. Correspondence. FBI correspondence. Reminder, certain objects are not allowed inside the Bureau. Recent incidents have necessitated an issued reminder on prohibited materials, unauthorized weapons, pagers, laptops, smartwatches, smartphones, smart gaming devices, anything smart, number two pencils, any objects considered iconic representations of an architect typal concept example rubber ducks ketchup bottles all materials under bureau investigation is to be brought in through private entrances if you see any lobby personnel in breach of these policies please notify your supervisor immediately case files you know do not have any records and research or research for records multimedia so I can do that and okay, so it's a zero though, zero, zero, one, zero. Okay. Load out G's exit menu, okay. Multiple contaminant search detected. Opening up by themselves. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Bureau expenditures. Bureau expenditures. Major. Staffing, surveillance, blank, data center initiatives, construction, blank, blank, minor, office equipment, janitorial costs, mold removal, HQ, livability costs. For cost breakdown spreadsheet, see page five for five year comparison. Yeah, I sprint like that. Shift while running the sprint. Okay, yep. Gotcha. Hello. Go in the bathroom. Federal Bureau of Control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. What happened here? Let me duck. Some reason I thought that was like an open window, but I think it's just a window with a uh, <clears throat> the blinds up makes a lot more sense. Security order. Shark in his blank, although secure, blank, permission to blank, following basic protocol, blank, shoot to kill, good luck. Attention all key. He's got a shark in his pants? Is that what he was going to say? The door, I can't see the door. Oh. Hello. Where's the 
door to that room. What the heck? Fucking run. R4 reports reminder. <clears throat> Hello. As you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request form R4E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, then you need to get written permission from your department department chief saying so. Remember, R4s are mandatory under section 75.2 of the employee manual. If your R4 requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Miss Marshall, Mr. Salvador, or Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. Best, your admin team. <coughs> Hello? Hey, excuse me. There you are. You are here about the job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm a janitor, by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they uh, you are no hell of it. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hound. What is he even saying? I've done mean? enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. <laughs> Ati the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No face. But that said, I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. Yeah. Exactly what I was thinking. I was already here, yep. Mm -hmm. All right. The cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Wow. Will you help? I'm gonna help. <clears throat> Starring Courtney Hope. Super weird. Is that thing's getting distorted? Did I lose you there for a moment? You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. 17 years since the men of this bureau took him. Wow. Well, we've got a story, man. Terminology reminder. Let's 
seek shelter. Reminder regarding drafting any public-facing material. While pending any notifications of death related to the Willow AWE, please adhere to the following guidelines. Words, words, phrase to use in the service of his or her country. Regret, proud pride, will be remembered. Words, phrases to avoid. Alaska, scissors, blood and bleed, loss, apologies, sorry. Do not disturb. Non official. Barbara, I'm not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day for the rest of the week. I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one. Trench. to get the noise in the director's office. Executive. Central executive. Okay. <clears throat> the director, Zachariah Trench. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Investigate. Oh, okay. So we got a map. The heck? And there goes the poster. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one, ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Oh, look at this place. Where am I? Follow the board's instructions to complete the Astro Plane Challenge. That seems in your minds. Service weapon. Hmm. Well, moving forward, ledges towards ledges. Climbing. Okay. Melee.
Service weapon regenerates ammunition automatically when not in use. Shots on these guys, it looks like. Wow. Now they're shooting back. Enemies drop health elements when damaged. Collect health elements to restore health. the pyramid spoke to me and it was just noise and I understood every word and this gun's alive you know what I'm happy it's like it's got a heartbeat happy to be here see it further into the bureau things have quieted down outside it's safe to go oh wow <gasps> what is that you can't let this happen you can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. You. Thank you. That was. horror. All I gotta do is like walk over the hill. Alright, I like the idea of that. I don't know what. Is that where I'm supposed to go? and it chills on my spine, man.
Marshall AWE investigations. And all this stuff. <clears throat> Objects of power. Objects of power can cause or be. We saw that already. For the Marshall's eyes only. Marshall, we checked out the suspected AWE in Duluth. Wasn't anything, just like the house fire before this and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team is getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find better, better a way to sort the fake AWEs from the real things. Or you need to rotate these field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're in route. The Sherman Ranch, next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Sincerely, Special Agent. Keenum. Service weapon. No unique procedures required. Description. The description. The object's form is variable. When bound, the object allows periutilitarians to blank. This object must only be bound by individuals seeking the role of blank. The object will determine whether blank. If rejected, the applicant is terminated. This process is dedicated, are dictated by the blank, though their criteria is unknown. All right. The hiss guards, zero expenditures. Okay. Nice. Weapon mod, shatter projectile. Cannot equip it. Projectile fire plus two. Hmm. Well, that's crazy. Uh, deconstruct. I don't want to deconstruct. Personal mods. One of twenty-four. How do I equip that thing? I equip it. Hmm. Figure it out, I guess. The hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. 